Why is it so flushed? Uh, I don't know. It got so banged up. It's fine. What are you making? I'm gonna to use this pot as a bit of broth in a smaller jar. Okay. I did it. I did another yesterday. You did a broth? Yes. Nice. Every couple weeks I do one. Squeeze me. What's the jingle? It's like da 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 da. Not with your singing skills, mm -hmm. no sir. Redolino, we got the food for you. All right. It's gonna be mush, tastic. It's gonna be soup. It's Federico, not Fredolino. I like Fredolino. Okay. It's just that thing. Hi, did you miss Fred and Mush? What about this guy? What about chopped liver? Chopped liver. Ay, 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 ay. Is it progressive? Dude, I don't watch commercials anymore. Because of my footballism I've been watching. I think I still had some in my head. People are saying it's nice to see Aaron. They yeah. love seeing you. I know. That's why I'm here. We give the people what they want. He does give the people what they want. And so does Freddy. Hi, France. France, Europe? Mm -hmm. Wow. That's a pretty Hi, cool COVID. Day. Yes. Eat up, Freddy. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, this diarrhea is horrible. <laughs> Shut up. Hi, Beijing. I couldn't make it to the bathroom, so I'm having my. my Somebody said it sounds like it's an Old Spice jingle, maybe. Oh, yeah, it is Old Spice. Old Spice. Yeah. Um, I decided to keep the old Burks. I did get one size down, but the one size down was like way too small because my toes were kind of scrunched. Um, so I figured it was not good. So I kept the 38. I already took them for a walk. They are giving me blisters. So I think we will have to just- You're an all birds person now? Wear them down. Burks. Oh, Burks. Not all birds. Not all birds. Jesus, no. God forbid. Hi, Singapore. Uh, just found out your cat has cancer. Oh, shit. Our cat? I'm sorry. No, Deborah. Oh. Deborah found out. Hi, New Zealand. <coughs> hi, hi, people at work. Hi, Finland. I'm also just stopping here for a little bit. Um, I was fired from Delish. Yeah. So, oh, oh, Jesus, where has that person been? <laughs> hi, Missouri, Missouri. Um, hi, Germany. So, I am here to show you Fred and Aaron and also to help Aaron cook some rice for his dinner because I've been using Aaron's computer to do editing. He has so nicely offered me his computer on his days away from the apartment and um, I've been leeching off of his technological supplies. And my electric bill. And his electric bill. Um, and uh, we will have a computer for me soon, but we're waiting on some parts. There's been massive price increases on certain parts. So. Only only GPUs, apparently. Okay. Hi, Suzuku. I met up with Eliza and Suzuku uh, last 
Friday. It was really fun. I was in Flushing for a dentist visit and we decided to just get together and go to a bakery and grab some baked goods and eat and it was fun. I didn't get murdered. Um, so some internet strangers are safe. Hi Baltimore. Yeah, people do not know about the Delish story, unfortunately. They don't know about the Aaron story. They don't know about the dead mom story. They don't know about the moving story. But you know what? Hey, for people who don't know, I have a whole YouTube channel. You can also Google me. Yeah, you're on it right now. There's actually also a very fleshed out document run by one of our viewers that is available on my info tab on this very YouTube channel you that has now. so much TMI that you are free to check out if you have the desire to, guys. You have the internet, my peeps. Also, Work for it. <laughs> also, live your own lives. Don't live June's life. Um, but anyway, yes. So, why no super chats? Because Google, aka YouTube, takes like 30% of your money and I don't feel like... Where the fuck have these people been? I don't feel like <laughs> they're giving asking like They're asking like elementary June questions here today. Yeah, I, welcome to the new people. I appreciate you being here, but you have a lot to catch up on. Don't worry. How are you such a Junie when you watch her lives? Basic shit. Well, maybe they're, the maybe, they're maybe they're new. Maybe they're new. Maybe they're new. Yeah, we love new people. Um. Okay, so this is my That's rice. That's flavor right there. I don't know if it makes sense to. Yes, it yeah. sure does. How much okay. rice do you want me to cook? Um. Yeah, a serving. A serving. Yeah, a serving's worth. I'm not cooking one serving of rice in that huge ass pot. Uh, fine, two servings. Actually, yeah, I can use it for fried rice tomorrow. That's good. Oh, this strainer is not good for rinsing rice in. Ready? Don't puke. You sure you only want two servings, Aaron? Let me see. Yeah, that's fine. You sure? Yeah, my okay. cook has me. Um, I scared him out of the puke recently. You scared him out yeah, of the puke? Yeah, I can tell when he's going to puke because he starts like heaving. He starts going like... Yeah. basically exactly the sound. Yes, And once exactly. I started doing it, I went over and I went, hey! And then he jumped and ran away and he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I, think, I think that makes that tells me it's more... It's more intentional than unintentional, than like uh, instinctual, because I think he just eats so fast that he feels weird. And so when cats, <laughs> cats puke a lot, you scared his vomit back in? Yeah, so. Wow, he, Dad. So he basically forgot to puke. Oh my God. <laughs> Our poor I think, boy. I think it's just that he eats too fast. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, that's good to know. You can scare the vom back in. May I come for water, please? Before. Cool water? Yes, that I'm gonna cook your rice in. Okay. You're done with the washer? Strainer? Maybe. Okay. Am I going to celebrate Lunar New Year? Uh, not that I know of. Can I have your lid? I guess now that I'm fun employed, I'm always at work, am I not? The irony of capitalism is that you're always employed, especially if you're self-employed. It's called grinding. Um, I had a very weird night last night where I fell asleep at like 7 or 8 p.m. Woke up at 9, stood up until like 9.40 or 10, fell asleep until 5, uh, stayed up until like 6.30 doing farm school homework and then fell asleep again until 
And uh, I had so many weird dreams, one of which was I was in a school cafeteria or a library. I can't remember which, but there were all these cliques of people. And then there was this girl who seemed very tech savvy, but like also very mean. And she had this guy sidekick with her and they were both on their computers. And it turned out that she was just like plotting this evil thing against me and trying to like fuck my life up. And um, it was very weird. I remember getting chased down in the bathroom by somebody else. So I guess I'm anxious and stressed, but I finally got enough sleep to dream about it. So yay for me. Um, life is weird. I will also show you this gift that Aaron got me. Oh, yes. Aaron went to my favorite Thai restaurant in the neighborhood called, I thought it was called Khao Kong, but apparently it's Khao Thai, Khao. so it's more like Khao Kong. But anyway. It is a custard filled pumpkin and guess what guys I'm filming another video of like everything that I eat in a week so this will be featured in that one. Um, I unfortunately will not be doing as many lives as you've probably realized because these videos take a long time to edit and not only am I working on these long epic ones I'm also working on short form ones just to try out different formats and see what kinds of content get eyeballs and what kinds of content I like making just dilly dallying um Sankaya it's called Sankaya okay Sankaya got it thank you so much and um you know if I'm not on a live it probably means I'm filming some other sort of work or that farm school homework is getting really intense because one day last week I did stay up until 4 30 a.m doing farm school reading, so it is rough, um, and, uh, you know, but I'm here. I'm just gonna keep turning out different kinds of content for you. I didn't open the nooch yet, but I will. Maybe I will put it into this week's everything that I eat. We shall see. I will put this by my bag so I don't remember, don't forget it. Are you sure? Do you want some of this? You're sure? Yeah, I thought you were going to try it on the live. Should I try it on the live? Should she try it on the live? I want to try it in the video. Okay. Do you want a piece though? <clears throat> I saw a pumpkin and I bought it. Thank you. Yes. How much was it? Six. than a dozen eggs, so. Well, there's more than just a pumpkin. True. You're on a boil, by the way. I know I'm on a boil. Right. I want it to be on a boil. I don't, June does rice better than me. So I lost my touch in my back. I don't know. It's on a boil because I put in too much water. Yeah, I know. Yeah. 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 Y
have you seen this new thing that people do on TikToks where... No, because I'm not on TikTok. I'm, I know, neither am I. But um, I saw Hassan posted, he, as a sort of joke, he, uh, his latest TikTok was like that, which is where it was like a clip from his Twitch stream where he was talking about whatever. But then also to the side were two other videos, one of like a knife slicing kinetic sand and another of like a Subway Surfer style game. So apparently on TikTok, it's popular now that like you have multiple videos in the same TikTok. So you, your brain like looks at multiple things at the same time because apparently just watching a 20 second video isn't engaging enough. So you need like multiple sources of like, you know, act stimulation at the same time in order to keep you engaged. Guys, I'm old. I cannot, I cannot do TikTok. TikTok is like so intense and it is so no, not addictive. A, yeah, not a duet. It's like literally you're, some people like need multiple videos to it's look at. It's breaking our brains. <laughs> it's breaking our brains. It's breaking our attention span. It's breaking our health. It's breaking our mental health. It's breaking our body image. It's breaking all of these things. I, TikTok algorithms, can give you really fun stuff. It can also fuck you up. I've heard so many friends go like, talk about how TikToks have ruined their self-esteem because it's like all hot young people on there with like so many different talents and you get cream of the crop. And yeah, Aaron definitely has a TikTok where he shows off his six pack abs and <laughs> sick dance moves surrounded by all the bitches that he has in his That's life. all true. <laughs> right, Freddie? Freddie has a TikTok too. Freddie has a lot of bitches, too. Listen, I'm going to milk this long-form video for as long as I can until other people start doing it, too. Do you guys watch June's videos on 2X? Do you watch my videos on 2X? I've been told that I talk too slowly, um, so... Somebody at work told me recently that he um, watches all videos, even, like, two-minute ones on 2x just because you, you just every that's what i'm trying to say nobody has attention spans anymore i sometimes watch videos on 2x too it just depends on my day um yeah 1.25 is actually a great speed for my voice my voice some people say they they watch my videos to go to sleep because i do have like a very lulled pacing of speech but 1.25 actually makes me sound like i'm alert i have an agenda i have a point I don't have a point, but it makes me sound like I have a point. Um, let's, let's do an exercise now. Say a couple sentences in real life at 1.25, June. Go fuck yourself. Oh, sounded one Go fuck yourself. Okay. <laughs> um, so, yes. Yes. Do you think it's possible to train yourself to speak faster? Of course it is. It's called debate club. Mm. Is it possible to train yourself to walk faster? Now, Absolutely. You have to consciously think of it every time. Like, walk faster, walk faster. Like, that just becomes your new faster walk. It's funny because I take so many walks around the city. Last time I went on a walk, I tried to practice the model walk where you kind of cross your feet in front of each other it slowed me down like 75 percent, i think and it also gave me a couple of moments where i was like i'm going to fucking trip on my face um but it was kind of fun i did it in like the no neighborhood like no people neighborhoods like the in-between graveyard of queens and brooklyn it's fun it gets boring to walk the same way especially if you're walking the same route every time he wants attention Do you guys want to see him ignore the new toy I bought him? Uh, here it is. He loved this for the first... Oh, apparently I talk out of one side of my mouth too, but... He loved this for the first three days he played with it, and now he ignores it. over there for it. Yeah, he went from going crazy and playing with it for a full half hour, 
like jumping on it, picking it up, swatting it around, to like vaguely lunging at it, to just looking at it, and lately he just like doesn't even bother anymore. I gotta go back to my rice. It's popping. Do you want me to do that thing where we crisp it up on the bottom? Oh, yeah, bro. Well, get your get your oil. Okay. Get it. Get a drizzle. I got new olive oil from Parrot. It's Albanian. Ooh. All right. Mm -hmm. yeah. Drizzle it up, girl. Wait. Got to turn on the light for the peoples. All right. Ready? So once your rice is cooked, drizzle in a little bit of oil. It'll seep down into the crust, and you just let it, it crisp up. It's okay. It smells like tomato-y. Mm. Sun-dried tomato-y. Yeah, he doesn't care. I bought a 10-pack of batteries for this thing when I saw how much he loved it. Oh, no. Mm, I don't think I need them anymore. <laughs> what kind of batteries are they? They're not even watch batteries. They're weird ones. Oh, shit. one. They're LR44s. Maybe I can use them for my scale. I'm not yeah, sure. Feel free to take them. LR44. Womp womp. Uh, what do I, how do I keep them entertained? Hi, California. Um, Fred is not to be entertained. He's too smart. Should like I? me. Should he I? only likes food. Like me. I'm going to buy real mice and let them loose in the apartment for him to chase and torture. Anything for my baby. That's really what humans do to everything, actually, including ourselves. We just put ourselves in little tiny apartments and torture ourselves all day long, running away from the boogeymans that we have created. Our own willpower creates nothing but misery. This thing is really good at pathfinding, though, for being... Computer. Yeah, it's like a little Roomba. Useless Roomba. Yep, just looking at himself here. That's cool, Fred. We'll just look at you. Then he knocks it over. It'll write itself eventually. Look at us. That's us. That's all of us. Just sideways, rattling around like a little piece of trash destined for landfill. We have all these batteries, but nobody actually wants us, so we don't really use them. He's more interested in the batteries than the toy. <laughs> And then we write ourselves again by going to therapy and we walk around waiting for someone to find us and love us and play with us. But, you know, nobody really wants us. They just walk away. They look at you. <laughs> they give you some attention. And then they abandon you. Did you see the little hop? Okay. Maybe it's play. Play mode activated you. Let's go, Freddy. Give us a show, you little jerk. Not under the fridge. Give us a show, Freddy. He's not going to give us a show, is he? I see you! Your eyeballs looking at me. They're 
If we can see you, the bug can see you. Anyway, let me show you the rice. You hear that? That's a good sound. Snap, crackle, and pop. As long as you hear that sound, but you don't feel like it's burning, or rather you don't smell like it's burning, you're on the right track to getting crispy bottomed rice. Um, that's about it, folks. I don't have anything new for you. Unless you guys have questions for me. Oh, there's a lot of comments. That Ask show questions up. about her latest video. I don't know even which one is my latest video. I have like four open projects right now. No, the one that you, that you uploaded. The one that they have actually been able to watch. Oh, they yes. Can't, they can't watch your unreleased video. Did anyone have any complaints about the one hour and 50 minute long vlog? If so, speak now or forever hold your peace. Um, or leave a comment. Or you can leave a comment. Comments are good. Apparently algorithms like comments and we feed we yeah. feed the monster. YouTubers I've noticed in the past few months have moved on to say not only like, subscribe, notify bell, but also leave a comment. How meta is this, bro? How scary would it be if like something happened in the glass behind me? Just the face you guys... no one. <laughs> Has there ever been a murder live on YouTube? A mere deer? Tell the hottie who made the noodles, hey girl, hey. Okay, what's your name? You want to DM me your number? I can hook you up. You oh, miss damn. my video journals for mundane things, walking around and shopping. Have I done those videos before? I don't know if Dan I have. Dan the hottie? Somebody's into Dan. What about, what about the hottie who ate the duck donkey? What about that hottie? You've had a lot of requests for you, Aaron. Oh, yeah? He's well, available, you. ladies. DM me. If you're interested, he's available. What, do you, what would you like to say to your future soulmates? Uh, boobies. Giannis is very cute. We went to college together. He is gay. We got gay folks who are into Giannis. Please also DM me your number. <laughs> I will hook all of you up with all of my friends, okay? They're all available, I think. So, DM me your number if you're actually interested. If you're a troll, go fuck yourself. Can you not add background music as you speak? I um, actually... I don't like YouTube videos that do the thing where, plus, like, low volume music is constantly playing in the background. It's not constant. Hi, Beverly. Welcome aboard to the chaos. Um, okay, Aaron. Well, your rice is pretty much ready. Okay. It's very crispy. You I'm can just, keep it crispy. I'm just, I'm not frying rice. So I'm just eating it with um, mala beef strips. Yeah, we got a few people who dislike the music. I'll take it into consideration, but as you know, this is not a democracy. But thank you for your feedback. I welcome it. That I got from H Mart. Take or look. Hot and spicy tofu snack. Rejected by Fred real hard. Did you see that? This is, I turn off these now. Why don't you go scrape it a little bit and see if it's the desired crispiness that you like? I mean, getting up close and personal on the camera is kind of my thing, you know? It's uh, like become my thing. So, not yet. Not okay. yet. You can see. So, we're gonna blast the heat. We're gonna blast it for a minute. And then we're going to turn it off, and we're going to let it sit. Right. You need a, oh, that's, that's the magic. How old is Aaron? Does that matter? Isn't age just a number? I'm the correct age. He's well, the I'll correct age, folks. He's the correct age. How's the weather in New York? 
It is very uh, November feeling. June looks really good for 41. <laughs> I wish I were 41. It really feels like I'm like 72 on some days. Why do you wish you're 41? Because it feels like I'm 72 on some days. know what you've been listening to lately if you don't mind sharing i still listen to your wiggles playlist the, wiggles? the, the jiggles playlist the jiggle? um you know if you follow that playlist and you click on my name on spotify you can probably see all of my playlists so other than that i just post music to my instagram story sometimes um what have i been learning at farm school that i am not good at reading fast anymore is 28 too young for most people? What kind of question is that, Freddie? <laughs> Doesn't that depend on the age of the other person? Okay, now I smell burn. We're going to turn it off, and we will wait for it to calm the fuck down. Do you usually do this with wood or no? I actually don't like soccer mommy that much. I don't hate him, but I don't like him. Um... You can leave the lid on or off. It's up to you how dry you like the rest of your rice. Just whatever it helps it not stick as much. <coughs> sure, lid it. Okay. Um, <coughs> I actually, I like single space printing. But uh, no, it's all digital. I don't have a printer at home, so I've been reading it on a screen, which obviously slows down my note taking because I have to like handwrite all of my notes instead of just marking it on the paper on the margins. So Aaron is either 35 or 29, probably 35 given June's reservations about dating and age difference. But you know, we got, we have been together for over a decade. So how do you know what I preferred over a decade ago? But you know, fascinating guess. Very, very informed hypothesis. I appreciate that kind of brain power turning. Um, um, you will be turning 69 in 13 days <laughs> and you expect this to be your last year? Uh-huh. Okay. I'm, Weird comments sure. in the live today. <laughs> yes. Okay. I mean, I hope, sure, if that's, if that's what works for you. Weird champ, as they say on Twitch. When did y'all become singletons? I guess you'll just have to do some Googling. Check, check June's Wikipedia page. I'm tired of saying the same things over and over again sometimes, you know. Wikipedia.org like slash June's year. Alicia says, came in on a weird note. Alicia, all of the notes are weird <laughs> in this song. Well, you really have some June noobs in chat today. <laughs> I welcome all the noobs. I look forward to breaking you. Um, you're turning 30 this year and sad to be leaving your 20s. I can I can see that, but I also was like so fucking ready to leave my 20s, honestly. Not that age makes any difference whatsoever. Some days I still feel like I'm half in my 20s. And some days I feel like I'm half in my 60s. So you take the average of that and I'm in my 40s. Aaron's right. Um, how old is Fred? Probably 12, 11 or 12. But he's still a baby. Look at him baby. be a baby. The churro? <gasps> churro time, Freddy! Yummers. He doesn't even let me squeeze it out. I know. <laughs> It'll be gone by the time I finish squeezing it out. Yeah. You know you can do that thing where you, like, um, slide it against the counter's edge and it squeezes it all out flat? Precisely. 
I got most of it with my fingers. Here you go. Fred is very boopable. Oh, he's got a he's got a goopish whisker. Yes, he always has a goopish whisker. How do you feel about your palm reading? I've never gotten it done before, but I know the one that crosses your like little thumb pad here is your lifeline. And one of my hands has like a broken lifeline. So <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna have two lives or just a really fucked up one. You How do you handle anxiety in your 30s the same way you handle anxiety at any point in your life? You breathe and you think about the fact that you're gonna die one day and this shit does not matter. So take a fucking break. That's it. Either that or you go on meds, or therapy, or meditation, or uh, eat better, or exercise. Just a lot of things. Or quit, quit your job that you hate, that you absolutely hate with all of your being. That does a lot for anxiety, too. Also, get out of toxic relationships. And um, learn who you are outside of people. You guys all writing this down? Yeah, done. Oh, sleep is good if you can sleep, but in my 30s, I can't sleep anymore. Like, that ability has been can taken away from me. Can whisker, maybe? Can I? Okay. Yeah, I enough. Oh, Ask a Mortician is pretty fun, too, yeah. I also smoke weed. Weed is amazing for sleeping, yes. Um, what is today's adventure? Nothing. Just watching Fred. That's it. You're gonna sit in your you're gonna sit in front of your bowl till I add more to it. You're gonna keep licking a completely empty bowl. There's nothing there left. <laughs> He alternates between licking a completely bone dry bowl and looking up at me. Do you still go clubbing in your 30s? I never went clubbing. Like, yeah, what do you mean still? I went to clubs maybe three times total, or maybe just two, two of which were in China, and it was only because it was just a small group of foreign teachers who dragged me there, Aaron included. Where I got free drinks and cigarettes for Be being white. And supposedly gay. All the gay guys, apparently. At the time, I would have done a lot for free cigarettes. <laughs> Jude and I were making a few hundred quiet a month. Um, oh, I have beautiful skin because my phone has no resolution, so it's cool. I love it. I love low-res phones. Um, but thank you for tuning in. I'm going to peace out. I'm going to go home, and I'm going to go finish filming videos because my whole life is... This is a really weird period of my the life. The content machine must keep churning. Yeah, this is a really weird period of my life where I'm just, like, giving myself anxiety uh, about what to film and what not to film. So still discovering the boundaries there. But I'm appreciative of all the people who liked the last video. So, yes? Yes? The content train must roll on. Say bye. Say bye, Freddy. 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 Say bye. Here. Say bye.